in this example we're going to look at pumping air from the surface to fill a container or perhaps it might be to supply a diver. Uh, it's a very simple question once again you're comparing a depth with the surface so it's similar to the previous questions we've already looked at when we're comparing to the surface. The question is how much air must be pumped from the surface to fill a drum that has a volume of 100 litres if it lies in 40 metres of salt water. Okay, so it's from the surface, it's going down, one, two, three, approach. First thing we do is look for the units, litres. How many litres are we given in the question to start with? We're given 100 litres, so step one of the three-step process, we write 100. Now we need to think multiply or divide. Well, let's think about this. We've got a barrel, it's uh, at 40 metres, it has a volume of 100 litres. We are going to pump some air down from a very flash looking dive boat to fill that barrel. What is going to happen? Well, hopefully you're already thinking to yourself, as air gets deeper, it gets denser and its volume decreases as that picture of a balloon descending just showed us. So the air we're pumping down to fill this barrel is going to get denser, its volume is going to get less. So we are going to need to pump more than 100 litres of air down to 40 metres to end up with 100 litres once it's at 40 metres. So we're going to multiply. So now all we need to do is look at the depth we're actually going to. It's 40 metres. What is the pressure at 40 metres salt water? It is five atmospheres. So we need to pump down five times as much air as we actually need to account for the fact it's going to get denser and its volume is going to reduce. The answer is C, 500 litres. You can find more videos, practice questions and study notes at my website www.goprocaribbean.com. I'm constantly adding new material to the dive theory section of that website. I can see new material being added at least until 2019 at the rate I'm going. Uh, hopefully you found this useful. Thanks for watching.